It's been over two years since the historic Sim Hackberry tree was cut down from the corner of High and Kohler Streets in Urbana. City officials and community members agreed the tree must be remembered beyond its natural life. That's when the Autumn Mill in Argenta, Illinois became involved. Owners Mark and Tammy Allen began a multi-year endeavor to process the tree. Well, when you was here in July, we were slabbing off the top of the, that, the big The nine-foot piece? The nine-foot piece in order to get it small enough to get on the mill. We ended up having to make six, six cuts, slab cuts with that Alaskan mill in order to get it down small enough to get on the, the, the big mill. And then uh, once we got on the big mill, that's when we cut it up into to lumber. Then it was put in the drying stacks to dry. And since that time, it's been drying, air drying, getting it down to about a 20% moisture content. After years of experience at the autumn mill, the Allens have the drying process down to an exact science. They're stacked with what's called stickers. Each one of those are three quarter by three quarter inches, about four feet long sticks made out of ash. Uh, which, that, are, which aren't reactive yeah, to, ash, to most wood. Ash will not react with other wood, so you won't get these staining and stuff like that. So uh, it's stacked in between. That gives you good airflow between all the stacks, and that's what you want. You want airflow between, on all sides of your boards in order to keep it from uh, getting mildew and, and fungus. And, and hackberry is particularly prone to staining. Yeah. So you really need good airflow on it. The Allens, along with city officials, are looking forward to the fruits of their labor. It'll be a really white wood with black, real dark black streaking through it. And uh, uh, yeah, very high, con also a, a kind of a rustic, rusty brown. Yeah. And for some reason, hackberry can get a fairly with the grain pattern that it has, it can get some fairly interesting grain patterns in it, and I don't know why that is, but it makes for some unique looking book matches. Lumber from Urbana's Sim Hackberry tree will be made available for purchase so the legacy can live on. For more information on the Hackberry tree and the city's legacy tree program, visit their website, urbanaillinois.us slash legacy tree.